Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Appa in case you guys are new here. Long time no see. I have been really really bad about filming I feel like this whole entire semester. I feel like you know a lot has been going on and I do have some news for you so I'm not gonna tell every detail in this video but I am moving in like a week so a lot has been going on I have been applying for jobs you guys like the past two months and it's been a process and I'm glad that I'm gonna be working in a system where they will be helping me with like work visa and stuff in the long run so and that is the exciting news i'm so grateful to god it's also like not in the evenings it's in the daytime and i function better during early mornings and you know the daytime so i'm really really happy for that and i just haven't had the chance to be honest so let's go ahead and get started today's video is an mt's video as usual i'm going to put the timestamp in the description box for you guys if you want to skip a particular category but without further ado let's go ahead and get started okay i think i'm gonna go with the beauty stuff first this time so we have some sulfate free argan oil and avocado shampoo this is one of the favorite ones that i have from this brand it's the herbal essence and I absolutely love it. I have been buying this one for a really long time, so I'm probably going to repurchase that. Then we have my favorite conditioner. This is the Tropical Coconut Conditioner from Suave. Love this one if you do have baby or curly hair like I do. Definitely give that one a try. Absolutely love that one. And then I have this sugar scrub from tree hut i absolutely love tree hut sugar scrubs and i probably will repurchase it i will say it did get quite messy and i feel like sugar scrubs usually in this tub form they tend to do that so unfortunately that was kind of eh -eh, but you know it is what it is and then i used up my white pumpkin body butter this is something which was part of my project use it up yes i will have that video coming up in a couple of days guys just give me some time so this one completely used up i will talk more about this in the bath and body works video the project use it up video i guess but I did like it. I probably will repurchase it in the future. And then we have this liquid lipstick which I finished. And this, I believe, is something that I got from... I think it was Sally Hansen. And I really like this color. And I probably would get it again if I, you know, am buying more makeup for now. We're absolutely doing a makeup no buy, you guys, because... I actually, you'll be surprised, I decluttered a bunch more makeup, um, even more than what I had before, so yeah, I just didn't film it, but I did declutter some more makeup recently. And then I have this foaming cleanser. I absolutely love this one. This was from a Korean brand, and I believe it's called Glam Fox they do have korean print here in the back so i'm guessing it's like and it says made in korea so i love this this was great for like my skin type you know it had that um creaminess to it and that's something that i'm always looking for in a face wash so i am probably going to repurchase this one as well let's see we have another body butter it's from that same brand and this is in vanilla spice I'm probably gonna repurchase it. It was really nice and I totally enjoyed this in the fall time. So that's a repurchase for sure. And then I have this uh, hand cream from Avon. I believe this was something that someone had given to me like a while ago and I was trying to use it up. I was using this during clinicals and I used it up. It was more like a Vaseline type consistency. It didn't necessarily have a strong vanilla scent or anything so it was perfect you know for the hospital so really enjoyed it probably would repurchase that let me just put this over here so i can 
quickly go through some items then i have this sinful colors nail polish this one dried out i also decluttered a bunch of my nail polishes so i'm just not taking a lot of things with me wherever i am moving which you will know soon and then i have this lightning shade adjusting drops i'm just decluttering this because i have lighter shade foundation that i usually use to adjust my foundation color and this one I feel like would work better for those of you who have a cooler you know skin complexion I have a warm skin undertone so it doesn't always work for me so I'm going to go ahead and declutter that sadly I'm also going to be decluttering this LA girl pro conceal it's for like I believe this orange one is supposed to be for correcting like hyperpigmentation I do have hyperpigmentation however I'm just not using this that much and I am wearing less makeup than I have been in the past just because of you know my profession so <clears throat> because with masks and everything so unfortunately I just I'm not using a lot of makeup so I'm just trying to get rid of them and then I have this toothpaste, nothing exciting from Crest. Already have repurchased that one several times. Then I have this Pons cream, like a face cream or lotion, I guess. It says beauty cream. Anyway, so I did use this on my face. I got it a long time ago. I was using this like as a travel size item. So I'm glad that it is gone and I probably would repurchase it whenever I'm traveling. Then I have this Dewy Luminex Photo Focus Face Primer from Wet n Wild. This one really gives you that glowy look if you're wanting for like an evening out or a night out. I really like this one and at some point I would repurchase it, just not right now. And I guess... No, I have one more item here. This is the Outlast Sweat and Odor from Secret. And I really like this one and I have been repurchasing it for a while. I still have another one in my bathroom. And then I have another liquid lipstick that I finished up. This is in Barracuda from Colourpop. So glad that I used it up. That was like a really pretty neutral color. And then I've used up this Fat Lash from Ioni. The wand was a little too big for me, you guys. But, you know, I used it. But I probably would not repurchase that one. Okay, then we have some lip products that I got through. I got through this NYX Liquid Lip Cream. I am not repurchasing anything right now. And I'm going to ignore that phone call. Maybe, or maybe I need to take it. Maybe I need to take it. Hi, Tom. Hi, Alpha. Hi. Can you give me some technical mentorship here? Okay, sure thing. That was my host dad calling, and I am going to continue to keep filming. We have this mascara thing or eyebrow gel thing, if you want to call it that. I have used that one up. I already have one that I use uh, from the same brand. That one was from Wet n Wild. Then this is a declutter. This is from City Color Cosmetic. It's a color correcting, uh, same color correcting for you know dark circles or hyperpigmentation. Just not gonna repurchase it now. And then I have this Urban Nights. Is it Urban Nights? I guess so. Um, shade from Jordana it's a lip liner I have used this several times and I'm so glad that it's done and that's gonna be out of my collection and I guess I have some hand soaps that I want to talk about this one is by scent theory it's in baked spice I use that one up I love my scent theory hand soaps you guys so definitely would be repurchasing and the keynotes for this say baked apple manuka honey grated clove and it just smells like fall like i absolutely just love this one this was like definitely inspired from bath and body like i could tell a smell like this 
usually is. And then I also have another hand soap. This is from the same brand and sweet almond and sandalwood definitely had that almond and sandalwood note to it really enjoyed it and the keynotes do say honey almond sandalwood bark and warm tonka i did smell the honey almond in it so really happy that i used these two up moving on to bath and body i know some people are here just for bath and body so these are all mostly items from my project use it up so i have raspberry jam donut in the shower gel absolutely love the scent will probably repurchase then i also have crisp orchard leaves in the lotion finished this one really enjoyed it probably would repurchase whenever it comes back usually scents like that don't really come back until unless it's like in high demand but anyways, then we have a raspberry jam donut in the lotion. Probably would repurchase it, just not right now, just whenever the summer SAS comes because I have a $50 Bath & Body Works card from my friend and that's probably when I'm going to use it is in the summer SAS. And now we have Beach Nights Summer Marshmallow. I love Beach Nights, use this one up, so glad that I had that in my collection and that I got to enjoy it. And then we have one or two more Bath & Body Works item here. This is Pumpkin Pecan Waffles in the shower gel. Absolutely love this one. Probably would repurchase that. And then finally, I have a candle here from Bath & Body Works. This is in Gingerbread Marshmallow. Love this one. And Mm, it just smells so good the burn was nice and clean and yeah beautiful packaging just love it you just cannot go wrong with their packaging i mean that's how they get you is the packaging and then i have this candle in pumpkin peppercorn um someone gave this to me and i actually really really like this one and even for a single wick this was very, very strong, you guys. Perfect for fall. I just loved fall this year. I just had a great time and I probably would repurchase that. And then I have this frosted cinnamon scented candle. Looks like this. And unfortunately, this didn't really have a very strong scent. And this was one of those candles from I believe a Dollar General and I feel like with Dollar General it's a hit or a miss for me so unfortunately that just didn't do it for me and then I have this Jam and Scents Pumpkin Spice this was a Dollar Tree candle again it was more for the ambiance didn't really have much of a scent and is that all the candles no one more candle that i have here this one was pretty good this is salted caramel butterscotch from mainstay absolutely love this one and i probably would repurchase it i feel like walmart local candles do a lot better than the dollar general ones so Overall, I'm pretty impressed with the Walmart and I'm probably just going to stick to their candles. But I just have been on a strong no buy, you guys, because of, you know, me moving out and that kind of thing. So thank you so much, you all, for watching. And I will definitely keep you posted on things going on in my life. Definitely this channel, you know, as much as I enjoy beauty and that kind of thing i feel like i'm at the point in my life where i want to vlog more and um, you can expect more lifestyle content on this channel still going to talk about candles still going to talk about bath and body works that's not going to change but definitely in the makeup department i'm probably not gonna you know do as many reviews and such thank you so much for watching hope you have a good one Bye bye